Hello, my name is Gilani. I'm an artist based out of Muscat Oman. Ever since my earliest memory, I've wanted to create art. I wanted to paint. I was obsessed with painting faces. But as I grew and uh, life had other plans for me, I started to do a corporate job and I almost gave up art altogether. I stopped painting and after 20 years, life brought me to Oman. It is here where I discovered my desire to paint again because I had this hollowness inside me and it was eating me up. I knew I had to make a change. I knew I had to listen to my true calling because all of us have a calling and we all have a purpose for which we are made. And for me, it was not going to a job day in and day out where I was not motivated. To everybody who's starting out, I have to say that the first thing you have to do is believe in yourself and you need to aim for the skies and you need to spread your wings and close your eyes and just soar and take a leap of faith because that is when you break your comfort zones. That is when you fly high. That is when the person becomes the artist or manifests the dream that they want, whatever it is that they want to do. I still wonder, sometimes looking back, how did I reach here? And I had to say that I just took a leap of faith in myself and that's what I have to tell everybody you know believe in yourself when I started my first uh, initial works I wasn't that great it was very mediocre because I had not painted for a really long time and then when I showed it to some galleries they actually turned me away and they closed doors on me saying you will never make it in this town and there is no hope for you don't try to be an artist, it's a waste of time. And you know what, I looked at them and I said, watch me. So I said, watch me. And I did everything in my power to develop my skill. Because no one else was gonna do it. I had to do it myself. And I was going to prove everybody wrong. And I had to rely on myself. No matter how bad my art was, I was going to make a portfolio and I was going to take it to every gallery I could, and somebody would buy it. I have to compete with myself because only when you make your own self your competition, that's when you are going to really reach your full potential. Because when you're looking at other people's work, if you compare yourself to other people's work, you're doing yourself a disservice. So believe in yourself and work to make it the best version of your skills. And then what I try to do is have fun. I dance, I shake, I rotate, I celebrate the whole process of creation. Because it, if it becomes just like a job, then why are we doing something creative? It has to be a celebration. And then I start to look at the finishing, which is quite an uh, observant step, step where you have to see the strokes, you have to see how uh, the colors are flowing and how the finishing is done. And finally, when it's all complete, I sign the painting. And that's when I know the painting is complete. And that's my process.